syncs up. Hopefully it does. Um, 2001 Rapunzel Barbie. She's so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't think I ever had any Rapunzel doll. I always really, really wanted one. Okay, but next, <laughs> this is gonna be a big part of a lot of your childhoods. I already know we have Curious George Barbie. She's so pretty. Okay, I think audio is good. Okay, see so you guys in the chat saying audio is good. I'm so glad. <laughs> okay, we have Curious George Barbie. She's already open. Should we just like take her out? Just kind of a glare. So, oh! what is that? Something just came out of the box and it legitimately looks like mouse poop. Oh no. <gasps> Scary. Ah. <laughs> oh, I don't like that at all. Oh, gross. Ah. Anyway. <laughs> The Barbie's cute though. She comes with a little Curious George and then her little dress with the drawing on it. <gasps> Guys, what is this that came out though? Okay, never mind. Maybe I don't want to open any of them anymore. <laughs> okay, so she is also a collector's edition. I'm gonna guess she's also around the year 2000. Let's see if we can find a date though. It says. 2000, exactly the year 2000, <laughs> so cute. All right, let's see what else we have in this box. Hopefully no more questionable poop. <sighs> Don't like that. Okay, next is Barbie Little Bo Peep. Oh my gosh, look at her little ringlets. This is so cute. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen this one. This one is from, let's see. It's so hard to find the dates. The dates are always on the, oh, 19. No way. Oh, no, 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 no. 1995. I thought it said 60. <laughs> 1995. This one's almost as old as me. How cute is she though? I love it. Okay. Next in our, what's looking to be like a 2000s fairy tale box is Barbie had a little lamb. <laughs> that is adorable. And she does have a little lamb. He's loose in the box. He fell to the bottom, but. Oh, now he's behind her. <laughs> there is a little lamb in the box though, I promise. And it comes with a little book. She's so cute. This one is, I'm gonna guess 90s also. 98, that's right. Do we have any 98 babies watching? That's your doll. <laughs> okay, did that have a price tag on it? Oh no, just a number. Next is, oh my gosh, you guys. This was my favorite stuffed animal growing up. I had a Peter Rabbit stuffed animal and now I have the Peter Rabbit doll. This is too cute. I'm gonna have to get that stuffed animal. I think my mom has it at her house, but that'd be so cute to display this next to my childhood Peter Rabbit toy on a shelf somewhere. <laughs> Let's see what year is this one. 19, oh, 2001. Okay, 2001. I would have been like six, seven years old. <laughs> That one's precious. All right. This is such a fun box. What a fun one to start with. Oh, I thought it was another Rapunzel, but it's not. This one is Princess and the Pea. <laughs> oh my gosh, how pretty. Look at her hair. Oh my gosh, have any of you read uh, Court of Roses and Thorns? Thorns, Thorns and Roses. She kind of reminds me of Feyre. <laughs> like her hair color and just her... Oh, she's so cute. Um, Let's see. She is... Can't, 90, I see a lot of dates on here. So, no, 2000. I think she's 2000, but that one's adorable. I love all of these. This is so good. Let me know which one is your favorite so far. Um, Adley, I had to get needles in my back and shoulders. I'm so sore. <gasps> what do you mean needles? I hope you're doing okay. <laughs> like acupuncture needles. <laughs> um, TT, hello from an old lady in Norway. You you brighten up my tough days with chemo. <gasps> Oh, TT, I'm so glad you're here. And I'm glad that the videos can bring you a little bit of joy in a tough time. Hope you're doing okay. Zoe says, I love you. By the way, this is my first live. Welcome to everybody that this is your first live. I'm so excited to have you here. This is a really fun first live. <laughs> um, Jordan says, hello. I just wanted to say you're my favorite. Jordan from Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. Hey, Tyler and I are from Idaho. Different part of Idaho. Our part of Idaho is not as beautiful as your Idaho, but <laughs> still. <gasps> Barbie Snow White, guys. She's beautiful. Look at her long hair, Snow White. Okay. We're so used to seeing Snow White with short hair, but I love the long hair. That's beautiful. Oh my goodness. This one is 90, 98. 
98. So this whole box is basically 95 to 2001. I see another princess. This one is Belle from Beauty and the Beast. Wow, she is beautiful. And she has these ringlet curls. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, beautiful. Oh, here's the whole collection on the back. Let's see, who do we have so far? We have Rapunzel, but not that Rapunzel. We have Bo Peep. We have Snow White, um, Sleeping Beauty. So we're missing a few. I don't know if they're going to be in here or not, but it'd be cool if we had almost the complete set. <laughs> Let's see. We have... Oh, another Peter Rabbit. Okay, are these different? Yes, we had a blue Peter Rabbit and a pink Peter Rabbit. I don't know which one I... I think I like the pink one. What do you guys think? Blue or pink? Let me get out the blue. We can side by side them, but... Um, so I have started sort of a little Barbie collection. So I think a lot of these I'm going to add to my collection, but some of them will probably end up on my hopescope.com website. So if you see any that you like, uh, remember them and check my website in like a week or so, because I'll probably put some of them up there. Um, yeah, like one of these. I think I like the pink one. She's cute with her little bangs and her fluffy hair. Oh, I love it. How fun. This is already so good. Okay, we have one more in this box and it is Barbie Rapunzel. Okay, this is like the 2000s Rapunzel. I don't think this is a collector's edition. Yeah, just 2001, kind of the classic from the movie Rapunzel doll. I feel like I had this doll. If my sister's watching, tell me if we had this doll <laughs> because she, she, we, I think we did. The dress looks familiar. For some reason, I don't remember having the actual girl, but I remember the dress for some reason and like the crown, but. <laughs> oh my goodness, so cute. What a good first box. Okay, put in the chat what your favorite one from this box was so far, but that was amazing. And I can't wait to see what else we have. <laughs> I think that was honestly worth all the money that I spent on that box. Um, Cads, hello, welcome. <laughs> Hope I love this Barbie area you're in. So and Brandon, your Barbie dream house video was so fun. Tried exiting out of YouTube, but the audio is weird. Uh, hopefully it's caught up by now. I think it's good, but thanks for sticking with me guys. <laughs> Through the technical difficulties. YouTube made like some updates to the live. So we're here, we're here though. Um, can't wait to see the Barbies. I'm so glad you guys are as excited about this as I am. <laughs> this is so fun. Christina, my 10 year old, and I love your videos. She's so happy we caught your live for the first time. <gasps> Christina and daughter, I'm so happy to have you. <laughs> and thank you for the super chats, guys. Um, Terry says, first live, my mom works for Mattel. Oh my goodness. <gasps> That's so fun. What a fun job. What'd you say, Tyler? <laughs> Tyler says, tell your mom to email him. <laughs> We were trying to get me to the Barbie premiere and it didn't happen, unfortunately. So <laughs> maybe Barbie two, cause you know there's gonna be a second movie with how popular this one's been. <laughs> Mara says, me and my friends always binge your videos. So excited to be on your live. Well, shout out Mara and friends. Thanks for watching. <laughs> okay, let's get our other two fairy tales out of here. Okay, I think you guys set a gold box next. Big gold box, is that what we're thinking? Part two. Oh, the part two. <laughs> I almost forgot. This is part of that one. They didn't quite all fit in one box. The store name? The store name? Yeah, your store. Oh, hopescope.com is my store where probably some of these will be next week-ish. So keep an eye on that. Uh, it, Tyler's putting it in the description as well. Um, and then if he's also going to put a link to my texting group, if you click the link, you'll get added to that. And I will let you guys know via text when the Barbies are on the website. Okay. <laughs> what is this? This is not a Barbie. <laughs> Wait, that's so funny. I feel like it's her pet dragon. That's so cute. Oh my goodness. Does it make noise? It feels like it has like a battery and stuff in it. Penelope the dragon. <laughs> Why is this dragon like so on brand for me right now though? This is my soul animal. <laughs> How cute. All right, that was our fun fairy tale box. That was great. Okay, I think we do the gold box next. Yes, that's what I'm seeing in the chat. Okay, this is another big one. Um, let's see. This one, I think there's a bunch of Barbies in it. It was like $180 on eBay. Let's see. <laughs> Leo gets so excited whenever I open these. He's like, what's in there? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay. 
gold box. We've got, oh my goodness, some cute paper, like marbly paper. That's fun. Oh my goodness. Guys, okay, I'm so excited for these. <laughs> this is something that whenever I was searching vintage Barbie dolls or collector Barbie dolls, this is something that came up a lot and they're very, very expensive. So I feel like we actually got a pretty good deal on these. They are the Wizard of Oz collection. And I feel like honestly, these are just gonna go up in value because there is a Wicked movie coming out, right? I'm pretty sure Ariana Grande is Glenda in the new movie. <laughs> so these are so cool to have. Um, I'm pretty sure these are from the early 2000s. 1999 actually is when this is from. We've got Glenda, oh, and her, her little wand. That's so cute. Okay, do we have the full collection is the question though. We've got her, we've got, oh yeah. We've got Dorothy. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. And Toto, of course, we have to have Toto. Oh my goodness. Her ruby slippers light up? How? That is, I feel like I can't open it and find out because it's a collector's, but I really want to know how her shoes light up. Press down on her heels. Wow, that's really cool. Did anybody have these Barbies growing up? Let me know. The OG, well, are they? 2000s? Was that the first time they came out with a Dorothy Barbie? It can't be. They had to come out with some like back when the movie came out. Okay, uh, Dorothy doesn't want to stand, <laughs> so she's laying down. Okay, we've got some other big Barbies, but we've, oh my gosh, look at these. They're little munchkins. <laughs> Tommy and Tommy. They have the same name. That's really funny. The lollipop munchkin and mayor munchkin. <laughs> Those are precious. <gasps> they nailed this Wizard of Oz collaboration. Wow. Okay. Next is Ken as the Tin Man. <laughs> oh my gosh. That is too cute. They even painted him silver. Oh, so funny because you can totally see the Ken face, but it's obviously the Tin Man. Wow. That's amazing. Okay. Collection's almost complete. What are we missing? Uh, the Wicked Witch and a couple other friends. Let's see here. We have the lion. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, this lion is so good. It looks exactly like the lion from the movie, Cowardly Lion. So good. Look at his like hair and his beard. That's impressive. Okay, so I think we're missing Scarecrow and then the witch is all. Oh, we have another munchkin. This is <laughs> Lullaby Munchkin. She's pink. I love her. <laughs> Three munchkins. Um, we'll have to see if I... I have all the munchkins because it has the three of them on the back. We've got all those. And the last doll in here is the scarecrow. <laughs> he also looks just like the scarecrow in the movie, but you can totally tell he's Ken still. That's so funny. Okay, did they have a Wicked Witch doll is my question. Let's see here. Um, looking at the box, no, I think we have the complete set. Why would they not make a, an Elphaba doll? <laughs> They've, I don't know, let me know if any of you have seen one, but I feel like this collection just needs that. But as far as what actually was made during this time, which I believe was 2001, 1999? I don't know, I'm seeing a couple different years. I think we have the complete set. This is really cool. I'm really happy about this. <laughs> <laughs> Childhood memories unleashed. I love it. I love to see it. I've had Glenda since she came out. I love her. <gasps> I love that some of you have had these and that you kept them. That's amazing. <laughs> Wizard of Oz is my favorite movie of all time. So cool. Tiana, thank you for the super chat. Hi, Hope. Love your videos. Me and my mom love watching your videos. I love the mother-daughter moments that you guys have watching these videos. That's so cool. Cause I had shows that I watched with my mom growing up. So the fact that like you watch me together is so special. <laughs> Maiden of Mystery 93, thank you for the super chat. Third live, been having a rough few months mentally. Your videos have helped me get through dark times. Love to Leo and Tyler too. Oh, we love you and we're so glad you're here. I'm sorry you're going through it, but you've got this. I'm not gonna lie, it's been a weird week for me too. Like nothing bad has happened, but the vibes have just been weird. So. 
I'm really glad to be doing this live. It always cheers me up and I love hanging out with you guys. It feels like I'm like on FaceTime with my bestie when I do these lives. So thanks for making my whole week, my whole month with these lives. <laughs> Stephanie says, hope my girl Liliana and I love your videos. <gasps> Thank you, Stephanie and Liliana. <laughs> you guys are the best. Daisha, is that how you say your name? That's really pretty. Me and my husband bond over watching your videos. I love it. <laughs> Tyler and I do that too. We have our YouTube videos that we watch every night. <laughs> Sophia's World says, hi, Hope. Love you. Please say hi, Valentina. <gasps> Hello, Valentina. <laughs> Thank you guys for the super chats. You are the best. Okay, let's put away our Wizard of Oz Barbies and get out the next box, shall we? Um, what are you guys thinking? A pink box next? <laughs> okay, those are so fun. Thank you. Um, let's see, let's do a medium sized box. I'm gonna do this medium sized pink one. Okay. Where'd my box cutter go? This is not my bedazzled one. Don't know where that one went, but this one works. <laughs> Fragile handle with care. Thank you, eBay seller, for not letting my Barbies get squished. All right. Oh, they're really, oh, nice job packaging this. What do you guys think it is? It's a big box. <laughs> it's, oh, still, wow, we've got even more packaging and tape. Okay, hang on, hang on. We're just building anticipation here. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, whatever this one was, it was kind of expensive. It was $150 just for this Barbie. Are you ready to see what it is? Oh! <laughs> yes! Okay, I didn't know if we got this one or not, and I'm so happy that we did. This is my favorite movie or series of all time. It is Lord of the Rings, <laughs> Eowyn and Aragorn. I'm so this is so cute. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Collector's edition. This has got to be early 2000s. Let's see what it says. Um, 2003. Yes. <gasps> I want to take them out. I know I shouldn't take them out, but I really want to take them out. <laughs> I loved these movies growing up. My dad read me the books when I was kind of little, like 10. And then as the movies came out, I just, I still love them. I love these movies. So good. Um, I haven't watched The Ring of Power on Amazon yet though. Have any of you? I've been nervous because like the series, the original series is just so good that I'm like, do they do a good job? Do they not? <laughs> so haven't watched it yet, but okay. So for those of you that don't know, there's the original actors and then the Barbies. They nailed it. Nailed it. It's so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh. I love it. Okay. Thank you. Should we open another medium box? I think. Let's see what's in this gold one. Okay, this one was $60. That's kind of a lot for a single Barbie, I would think. Let's open her up. <gasps> this is my favorite Barbie. Guys, this is my favorite Barbie from when I was little. Are you ready? <laughs> and when I say little, I mean like, I played Barbies till I was probably 15 or 16. So like preteen favorite Barbie, I would say. Here she is. It is <laughs> my scene. <laughs> Let me know if any of you played with my scene dolls. I loved them. I loved their computer games. And the Masquerade Madness collection was my absolute favorite. I remember this DVD. Me and my sister used to watch it all the time. All of the dolls in this whole collection were so pretty. So this one is Barbie, which I'm pretty sure Mattel actually sued whoever owns my scene over that name. I think they ended up having to change her name, but this is one of the early collections. So we still had Barbie. And then here's all the characters. I actually would say Chelsea was probably my favorite out of them all, but I couldn't really find any Chelsea dolls. And then Madison was really cute too. I'm pretty sure we had all of them. I think we had the whole crew probably multiple of the crew, but we loved these. They also had a Jammin' in Jamaica collection that came with a DVD and I loved those, but isn't she so, wait, I just realized she is a butterfly that matches the butterfly dress that I got a couple videos ago and that I posted on my Instagram. Do you know what I'm talking about? Let me know. How cute it was like meant to be. Um, 
She has some random boots floating around in here somewhere. That's funny. <laughs> okay, well, there she is. She has her little outfit she comes with too, some little accessories, but what a fun one. I'm kind of sad that they don't make these anymore because it was great. The computer games were great too. Let me know if you remember those. <laughs> So fun. All right. Gabby says, love your vids. If you give me a shout out, that would brighten my day. Hello, Gabby. <laughs> Thanks for the super chat. Cheryl says, 1985 Dream Glow Barbie is the best. And I hope you got one. It was my favorite toy. And it was lost in a flood. Oh my goodness. That's so sad. I think we do have some from like the 80s and 90s. They're coming up though. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Kara says, this is so much fun. I have an extensive doll collection that includes Barbies from my era, the seventies. How fun. I'm hoping we have some of those too. It's been so cool. Ever since my dream house video, I've gotten some messages from you guys on Instagram that have like legit collections. And I'm about to join you because I think I'm addicted to Barbies at this point. It's just so fun to have all these different ones from different eras and different stories. Haley says, love your videos. This is my first live. You're my favorite person to watch on YouTube. Thank you so much, Haley. <laughs> that is the best compliment. Uh, Kate, Katie is asking for Leo. Lee, do you want to come be in it? I think he's scared of the boxes. Once we get rid of the stack, he'll probably come up and hang out, but he doesn't like the boxes. <laughs> Shannon says, this is so fun. <laughs> Thanks, Shannon. Jess, thank you for the super chat. Say hi to my son, Levi, please. It's his first live. Hello, Levi. Thanks for joining us today. <laughs> this is so fun. Glamma, love that name. Hi, Hope, I'm 62 and I love watching your channel every day. You're the cutest thing ever. Hello, Tyler and Leo. Oh my goodness, thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Celine, hi, this is my first lives. Greetings from Argentine. Argentine? Am I saying that right? Argentina. Argentina. <laughs> Hello, welcome to the live. So cool to see all of you from all over the world. A Key says, first live, hope is by far the most interactive and my favorite YouTube creator I've come across. <gasps> thank you so much. That's so sweet of you. And thank you so much for the super chats. <laughs> you guys are the best. Maddie says, I dyed my hair the same way, Hope. You really are my favorite YouTuber. Me and my little sister watch you all the time. That is amazing. <laughs> I'm gonna tell my hairdresser, she loves it when I send her pictures and stuff of people that have also done this hair. <laughs> it's so fun. This was supposed to be like a temporary thing, but here we are a year and a half later and I still have the pink hair. <laughs> it's just fun. <laughs> All right, next box, I think. Does it matter? Okay. <laughs> Anna says, what, whichever one we watch. Should we do a big one. I think we're due for a big one. Let's see this big pink one. Okay. This one was $300 from eBay. Um, we've got a bunch of dolls in here. I have no idea what. Let's see. Um, I don't know which way is the top. I'm gonna guess this way. Guys, what's been your favorite one so far? Let me know. <laughs> Somebody said, do you drink boba? <laughs> the boba's fun. Um, there actually is a smoothie from a smoothie shop here that I get that puts boba in the smoothie and it's so good. It's like an avocado smoothie <laughs> and then they put bobas in it. Very yummy. Okay, we've got a bunch of newspaper. <laughs> Imagine it was newspaper from the year that the Barbies are from. <laughs> it's probably not. Okay, we are making a mess right now. You should see the ground at the moment. Oh, we've got some vintage ones. I can tell by the packaging. Here we go. We've kind of just been in like the late 90s, early 2000s this whole time, but I think these are some true vintage ones. All right, let's go with this one. Bicycle and Stacy. Okay, I don't really remember. Whoa, I remember Skipper, but I don't really remember Stacy. Is Stacy Skipper's little sister maybe? Like older than Kelly. Yeah, oh, little sister of Barbie. See, I, I, I'm not very caught up on my Barbie lore. Like, I don't know the, I'm guessing Barbie's the oldest sister. Oh, oh my gosh, wait, is it right here? No, these are her friends, these are her friends. So Janet and Whitney are her friends. And then Stacy is Barbie's sister. That's so cute. And they come with a little bike and a little dog in the basket. That is adorable. Bicycle and Stacy. Oh, what's the year? Let's see. Maybe some of you in the chat can guess it before me. 1996. Okay, I thought it was gonna be older than that, but 96. All right, what else do we have? City style Barbie. Look how cute she is. This one's gotta be early 90s. The outfit's kind of giving 80s. Let's see. 
96 again? Interesting. I hope I'm getting these years right. It's kind of hard to tell because there's a lot of different years on the box, but special edition. She looks like she's getting ready to go party. <laughs> it's so fun. Yeah, let me know if any of you know if I'm wrong on the dates, but I'm pretty sure this one is 1996. Because then they have the dates of like when the Barbie like base doll was made in the early 90s and like when the collection first came out. So it's kind of confusing, but okay. Here we have American Beauty Queen Barbie. This one's cute. She has like the poofy beauty queen hair. The cutest blue dress. It looks like blue leopard print. That's fun. Oh my goodness, three looks in one. So she has the big poofy dress. The skirt comes off to a smaller dress and then she also has a swimsuit underneath. That is so fun. And free Barbie trading cards inside. Do you think that's worth anything these days? <laughs> oh my gosh, I love her. Okay, this is 1991, all right. <laughs> Now we're getting into the early 90s. Next, oh my gosh. <laughs> hey, this looks familiar. Oh, but it's different. <laughs> it's Barbie Wizard of Oz, but it's mini versions, Kelly versions. Okay, now I think we have every single Wizard of Oz doll. <laughs> if we didn't before, <laughs> those are adorable. What a fun box. This box has like no rhyme or reason to it and I love it. Okay, next up is Evening Enchantment Barbie. Wow, okay, she's this like, wait, is this another two-in-one? Cause this dress in the picture is not the one she's wearing. So I'm guessing this skirt comes off too. In a twinkle, skirt reverses to glitter. Wow, really cool. Sears special edition, it says. <laughs> Sears must've been like the place back in the day to get toys because same with some of the dream houses, they were series. Sears. Sears special editions that you could only get at Sears. Sears was like the first big store ever. Sears was like the first big department store. Yeah, they had a catalog and everything. I thought JC Penney was, yeah, but this is yeah, I did not know that. I'm not seeing a year on this one, but she's gotta be also 91, 94 or something like that. Okay, next up is, <gasps> oh, she's cute. What is she called? United Colors of Benton? Is that just what she's called? <laughs> I'm not sure, but she's so cute. And here they all are. I don't know the story behind these ones, but they're cute. Teresa, Christy, Barbie, Ken, <laughs> Marina doll. How adorable. Okay, year on this one is 1990. I think that's our oldest one so far, but don't you worry, we have almost the world's oldest Barbie in our possession. I couldn't find the first ever Barbie, but I got a Barbie that, I think it was literally the next Barbie that came out. We've got a true classic on our hands coming up in this, this flower box over here. <laughs> so far, 1990 is the oldest one though. Okay, we have, oh my gosh. <laughs> Eaten Fun Kelly, babysitter of Barbie. Oh my gosh, that's so cute in her little high chair. <laughs> And then I don't know if you can see what she has like little foods up here, <laughs> baby foods. Try me, I lift my cup, what? How does she do that? That's kind of creepy, what? Oh, she has a lever. Can you see the, the lever on her back? Okay, let's see if we can get it to work. Oh, yep, do you see her hand moving? <laughs> that is too funny. Oh my gosh, now I want the babysitter Barbie that goes with her though. Okay, let's see. The year on this one is, Barbie not included, 1997. <laughs> okay, what else do we have in here? Butterfly art Barbie. Oh, this is the most year 2000 thing I have ever seen. <laughs> it's a Barbie tattoo kit. I feel like we have to do another live somewhere and we have to give her tattoos. That is too cute. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Do not apply tattoos to sensitive skin. Oh, can you put on? Oh, you can put it on yourself too. Look at this. <laughs> How fun. And there's a bunch of them. A bunch of different girls from this collection. Okay, so this one is 98. That makes sense too. I would have guessed 2000, but 98 makes sense. <laughs> Guys, this is so fun. All right, we've got two more in this box. We have... Teen Skipper. Okay, yes, this is exactly what I thought. Barbie's the oldest, Skipper's the teen. Who was it? The one that we just opened. Stacy is like the preteen and then Kelly, I think is the youngest. If I had to guess the family, that's what it seems like. Oh, cute. This one comes with sparkle tattoos. You guys see those up there? Some sparkly ones. 
Oh, those are so adorable. I love her outfit. <laughs> I love that this like style came full. <gasps> she has my hair too. <gasps> I almost didn't notice. She literally has a pink streak in her hair. Do you see that? So cute. Oh, look at them all. Oh, this is a pretty collection. I love these ones. I want all of these ones. <laughs> okay, this is 1996. Ah, that's one of my favorites so far, I think. <laughs> all right. Barbie Skipper, Stacy Chelsea. Oh, you guys are throwing in Chelsea? I haven't seen one of those yet. <laughs> so Kelly's not related then, and Chelsea's the youngest sister. Oh my gosh, Got Milk Barbie. There's nothing more 90s, 2000s than a Got Milk Barbie. <laughs> I remember going to school and in the school cafeteria, there were got milk posters everywhere with like the celebrities and then have milk all over their face. That was like a movement back then. So that is too funny that they came out with a Barbie. Look at her little cow print overalls. So cute. Let's see the year. Oh, there is a cookie recipe. I feel like I need to try this recipe now. <laughs> Barbie doll's favorite cookies. Just ask an adult for help. Hey, Tyler. I'm probably gonna need help. 1995. Wow, what a fun box. Okay, we haven't gotten any super old ones yet, but that was a really fun 90s box. I just love, I love the whole vibe of the 90s Barbies. They're little pink boxes. This was a fun one. <laughs> Let me know which one was your favorite, the fairy tale box or the 90s box so far. Oh my gosh, I don't know how to pick. I really liked both. I feel like I definitely remember more of the fairy tale Barbies than I do these ones, but these were a fun surprise because they're pretty new to me for the most part. Nicole, thank you for the super chat. My nine-year-old daughter loves watching you with me. Can you say hi to Artemis? That's that is cool the name. coolest name. Thank you. Love your channel so much. Thank you guys. <laughs> Cads, Cads again. Cads is the MVP. <laughs> My scene, that computer game had me in a chokehold. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, you have to go look up the Mycene computer games. They're probably still fun. There was like a nail painting one and like one where you would get ready to go on a date. They were so fun. <laughs> Okay, Ali says, my daughter Leana and I are so excited to catch you live. We watch you together all the time. Thank you for being a good role model. <laughs> Ali, that is the sweetest compliment. Thank you guys so much. And thanks for watching. Jessica, thanks for the super chat. I've been watching your videos over and over again. I think you're an amazing person. Never change who you are. <laughs> you guys are too sweet. I love this community. Emily, Emily, thank you for the $20 super chat. Are you kidding me? <laughs> My daughter May and I love watching your videos together. You're a great mo role model to young girls. Sending love from Traverse City. <gasps> thank you, May and Emily. <laughs> you guys are the best. Heather says, can you shout out my niece Haley, please? <gasps> Haley, shout out. <laughs> All right, next box. What are we thinking? Let's do this pink medium one, I'm thinking. Lee, they want to see you. They're in the chat saying they want to see you. Come up here. Come here. Come on. I think we got to open these two boxes and then I guarantee he'll come up. He's just a scaredy dog. <laughs> okay, let's open this one. No idea what this one is. Uh, okay. Oh, oh, he's trying to come up. <laughs> hey, you can come if you want to. All right, fragile. What do you think? Is there gonna be one Barbie in here or a bunch? I genuinely have no idea. Could go either way. <laughs> Not sure how much we paid for this one. We got more newspaper. It's a... What is it? All right, let me cut it. Are you ready? Oh, I know what it is. Okay, I feel like this one's a little more niche. Please tell me some of you remind these. The feeling that these bring up for some reason. I don't know why I loved the Winx girls though. They had like a cute little TV show too. This one's Bloom. Ah, oh, they're so cute. Just these little like fairy girls and they would go on adventures. Um, There's like a whole group of them. Yeah, Flora, Stella, Bloom, I think were the main three. And then Tecna and Aisha, I don't really remember them, but I remember the main three girls. <laughs> These are so cute. I know that I had a Winx doll. I can't remember if it was 
I want to say it was Bloom. I really liked Bloom. She's cute with the red hair, but that was a good early 2000s one. Let's see, 2000, 2012. Okay, I had this one earlier than 2012. Oh, Winx Girl. So that makes sense that there's characters I don't know because it must have went on longer than I thought it did. I probably was more into them in like 2008, but they're so cute. I love them. <laughs> All right, a Winx Girl. How fun. These were actually surprisingly hard to find. Same with my scene dolls. Like the kind of more niche ones. Yeah, this was, this is it though. <laughs> They're so cute. Um, they have really long legs too. They're like totally different than a Barbie, but I remember having fun with those. All right, Winx Barbie. Let's open this gold one and then maybe Leo will come up. <laughs> La Famille Ventura, watching from Canada. My six-year-olds and I are obsessed with your videos. Also, she's in her Barbie era. It's so fun to watch your Barbie vids lately. I feel like we're all in our Barbie era right now. Like, how can you not be? <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Samantha, I love my collection of Barbies now passing on to my nieces. I love that. I love the witches and have the secret spell dolls that were discontinued because they were evil. <laughs> Wait, that's too funny. I have to look those up. I bet you'd love my Galadriel and Samantha from Bewitch. Is that how you say it? Ga Galadriel? <laughs> that's really cute. <laughs> That comment made my day. Um, my daughter, Nevea says, hi, ready for the Barbie movie? She bought the new People Magazine Barbie edition, shows Barbies throughout the years. I'll have to check that out. That's really cool. I've been loving Barbie throughout the years stuff, obviously. <laughs> Tammy, I can't believe I finally caught a live show. Love your show and you guys. Thank you so much, Tammy, and thank you for the super chat. <laughs> Tiana, hi, Hope, watching with my six-year-old sister. Ah, hi, guys. <laughs> All right, big gold box. Lee, this is your time to get on the couch. I can get up. He's like, I don't know about it still. That's a big box. <laughs> okay. Um, I have no idea what this one is either. It's gonna be a mystery. I know we have more than one Barbie in here. Though. Ugh. Okay. I can't tell. Oh, this is definitely the top. Okay. It's like Christmas, guys. It's so fun. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> right on top we have, okay, this one's gotta be old. It's a Star Trek Barbie. Okay, I watched Star Trek with my dad growing up. Like the original, is this? 80s Star Trek? I want it older than that, maybe 70s? I can't remember. But I watched this series with my dad growing up, so this is really, really cool to have. Oh, I can't see the year. I don't want, I feel bad taking off this plastic, but I think I have to, to see the year. Let's see, I think I just cut open the bottom. Let's see what this says. Um, 1996? They look older than 1996. Maybe it's just because the plastic has kind of yellowed though, but that is too cute. I love it. <laughs> All right, great start to this box. This one I'm keeping. That one's really awesome. <laughs> All right, next up is Francie. Who's Francie? I don't know, but she's cute. Look at her little lime green box. 1966, is that for real? <gasps> okay, is she actually from 1966 or did they remake her 30 years later? I think that, yeah, <laughs> 1996. So this was a doll from 66, but they made an anniversary version. That's cute though. Okay, this is our first like vintage style Barbie though. You can totally see how the body kind of changed and the face kind of changed. I feel like they used to have a little bit I'm not gonna say realistic features, <laughs> but a little bit more realistic. Like her eyes weren't huge back then. Oh, this is so cute though. Her little 60s style outfit. That is adorable. How fun. Okay, so we have not quite true antique vintage, but a fun throwback one. All right, next up is, oh, I see some holiday Barbies. I do have a few holiday Barbies in my collection already. Um, wait, I wanna see what this one is. It's. Barbie Dreamtopia. I feel like this one's not like, yeah, 2021. <laughs> okay, whose childhood was this? 2021, let me know. <laughs> so cute. Oh, I would have loved that one when I was little though with the pink hair. So cute. Okay, 
we just, we have quite the mix so far, 2021 and 1990. <laughs> Next up is Vintage Classic. Um, what's her name? Just, oh, Winter Classic, not Vintage Classic. Special Edition. She's cute. I like her. Is this considered a holiday or just winter? I'm not really sure, but yeah, she's really pretty. 2001. Did they just make like a bazillion Barbies in 2001 or what? <laughs> I feel like we've gotten so many 2001s. <laughs> okay, um, let's see. This box looks kind of old. Oh my goodness, Native American Barbie. <gasps> Her outfit is beautiful. That's really cool. Let's see, this one is 1997, Dolls of the World. So they must have done a whole collection with a whole bunch of different, yeah, here they are. They have a Chilean one, a Polish one, and a Thai one. <laughs> How fun. Oh, these are so cool. And they have like little facts on the back. I love it. <laughs> okay, next up, yes. NBA Barbie, which team is it gonna be? <gasps> Guess, guess which team is it gonna be? Here's all the different teams that they have. <laughs> oh my gosh. And I guess is the Bulls. Do they even have a Jazz one? <gasps> they don't, that's rude. Okay, ready for the reveal? The Bulls! Oh my gosh, it really is. <laughs> okay, if we can't have Jazz, I'll take the, that's so cute. That is really cute. <laughs> she even has a little basketball, the little jersey set. This has gotta be 90s, cause I feel like that, yep, 1998 was like peak NBA Bulls the days. <laughs> That's a fun one. I really like that one. Okay. I am Polish with love the Polish Barbie. <gasps> I wondered if any of you guys. <laughs> the Lakers. I think there is a Lakers Barbie. Yeah, there is. I know she's cute too. <laughs> okay. NBA Barbie. I didn't even know that was a thing. Me neither. I've never even heard of that. Okay. Next up is... Chinese Empress Barbie. Okay, I haven't heard of this one either. Is this part of the dolls from around the world? Travel throughout time with Barbie. The series takes you on an exciting journey to famous ep ep epochs, epochs from yesteryear. Okay, so there, there was like a going back in time Barbie collection. And this one, oh, wow, how cool. I didn't even like think about Barbies from around the world when I was ordering all this stuff. This is so cool. Her outfit. <laughs> this is dangerous though. Cause I feel like I have one of every collection now and part of me is gonna be like, what if I just finish the collection? <laughs> I don't need to, I, I have so many. I don't, I don't need any more. Okay, we've got a holiday Barbie coming up. Any guesses what year? I don't think I have this one yet. I think I have the two years on either side of it, but this is 2001. Okay, I remember this doll specifically. I'm pretty sure my aunt had it. She was the first person that I ever knew that collected Barbies, specifically the holiday ones. And I remember looking at her collection and they were all so beautiful. And I remember her having 2001 holiday Barbie. And I just thought it was so pretty in the red with the silver dress, so cute. Did you need something or you just come and hang out? Yeah. Tyler, do you want to show me your outfit? <laughs> Tyler's yeah. Ken outfit. Yay. Rate my outfit one to 10. <laughs> oh, I, I didn't like, even show you guys my outfit either. I feel it says like Ken has it like unbuttoned though a little bit more. It's kind of awkward, <laughs> but I got the shorts to match. I love it. <laughs> um, so I actually got a bunch of these sets. They're from PacSun. I totally have the size sticker on, don't I? I do that a lot. Um, and it comes with like little shorts. I got, I thought I got four of these to gift to you guys. And turns out I only got four size large shorts and no other crews. So I really dropped the ball. I was going to do like a big Barbie giveaway for you, but I messed up. I'm sorry, <laughs> but I am giving away a Louis Vuitton bag on my Instagram slash threads this weekend. So make sure to follow me on those if you're not. Um, okay. Next Barbie. Radiant Rose Barbie. <gasps> what is this? Limited edition Barbie dolls, society style collection. Interesting. Oh, wow. Look at her velvet dress. That's cool. It's like Disney princess vibes. I don't think there's a Disney princess that has an all red dress like this, is there? Is there not a Disney princess with a red dress? She's so pretty. Like it kind of looks like Belle, but 
Bell's yellow. That's a pretty one. That's cool. I don't, I've never heard of this collection, but what a pretty one. Okay. Next. Oh, wait, what is this? <laughs> they threw in a free gift. It's a little notepad that says believe with a, a unicorn. That's so funny. Thank you, eBay seller. <laughs> All right. Oh, I think this is another Barbie around the world and it's the Thai one. How cool is she? That's a really fun one with the headpiece, the outfit. I love it. It has the facts on the back again. Okay, so now we have two of the four Barbies of the world. We're just missing Chilean and Polish. Maybe they'll turn up in one of our boxes. Okay, our stack's getting big over here. <laughs> okay, next is, whoa, whoa, whoa. There's more Barbies of the world. This must, this is French Barbie. She wasn't on the, <laughs> in the catalog. Dolls Around the World collection. There must have been like an OG Dolls Around the World and then they came out with like another one because this is French. Look at her outfit. <laughs> that is so fun. The lace and the flowers, too cute. Yeah, because same thing, it has the facts on the back and we've got French, Puerto Rican, Russian, Arctic and Ghanaian in this collection. Yeah, I haven't seen any of those yet. This one is from 1996 and then this one is uh, 97. So they must have done one line of them and then people wanted more. So they came out with another. That's really cool. We've got France now. <laughs> Cute. All right. The last Barbie in this box is Fashion Avenue. Oh, she's pretty. I actually love her dress. I would own that dress and the choker and the gloves. That's cute. I just love the redheaded Barbies. I don't know what it is, but like I said, the Chelsea my scene was my favorite. I just, the red hair. And then Ariel was like my favorite Disney princess. And of course I had an Ariel Barbie. It's just so pretty. <laughs> okay, what's the, oh, here's all the different ones of this. Okay, I think this is definitely the coolest Fashion Avenue one. Um, it's from the year to 1989. That sounds about right. Oh, she's so cute. Okay, that was a fun box. It was another kind of 90s box. I like it. We had a little bit of everything in that one. I think my favorite one from this box is probably NBA Chicago's Barbie. That one was so fun. <laughs> okay, and then of course the red. Oh, Lee, you made it up here. Welcome. <laughs> I didn't even see him come up, did you guys? <laughs> yeah, uh, NBA Barbie, and then this is the holiday Barbie I always really wanted, so. I'm excited about those too. <laughs> I love the 2021 thrown in. We just have a little bit of everything here, literally. Okay. Hello from Montreal. When I was a child in the 80s, my aunt gave me two Barbies per year at my birthday and at Christmas. At 10, I had a dozen, LOL. I love that. That's such a fun tradition that it was always Barbies at those two times. Love it. It's my birthday, Mandy. Happy birthday. I'm 32. We're going to buy a Barbie and see the movie this weekend. I've been loving your Barbie videos. Been a Barbie girl forever. I love that idea. <laughs> that is so cute. <sighs> Go pick whatever Barbie you want in the whole store. How fun. <laughs> Okay, uh, Livy14, hi hope, you are the best YouTuber. Thank you so much, Livy. <laughs> um, Claire, I love you, just defeated cancer. You've, you've made me through the darkest times. Claire, you got yourself through the darkest times, but I'm glad I could be along for the journey through videos, I guess. So I'm so happy for you, so proud of you. Oh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> you guys are just the best. Oh my goodness. Lara, I am a Dutchy watching from the UK. You are my favorite YouTuber to watch and never fail to make me laugh. They honestly should make a Barbie doll of you and Leo. That would be iconic. I have something to show you. This is not a Mattel product, but <laughs> I, I feel like I've shown this to you before, but I just love it. My sister made this for me, I think for Christmas a year or two ago. How cute is it? It's a Hope Barbie. She literally dyed the hair pink. She made like my YouTube plaques and a Leo and little accessories, a little like YouTube kit. She even put the Mycene magazines in it. That's so funny. I think those were literally our Mycene magazines from when we were little. I think actually a lot of this stuff is from when we were little. Like I remember that pink dress playing with that. And then she even like did the back and filled it out with facts about me and stuff. How fun is that? So if you're thinking of like a creative gift to give somebody, make them a Barbie doll. Like I thought that was brilliant, <laughs> too cute, but 
yeah, it'd be cool to have an actual Barbie of myself someday. That's like ultimate dream come true. <laughs> Johanna says, I have, you have the Star Trek Barbie? That's really cool. Cause I've actually never seen that until today. It was a special edition for the show's 30th anniversary. Okay. So that means it did come out in the late sixties. Is that right? If the dolls are from 1998, that's awesome. I love your channel. Thank you so much. <laughs> Okay, my daughter Kylie loves you, slay girl. Hello, Kylie. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Bridget, I love that name. First time live for this 50 year old chick from Nova Scotia. <laughs> That's a Western Barbie and Ken on your shirt. Yes. Okay, so is this like legitimately the OG Western Barbie and Ken? I was wondering that if they had Barbies <laughs> like this. I think it's too cute. Also, look at Ken's pants. They're so tight. I love it. <laughs> Fun. They came out with like a Malibu one too, but I really liked the Western. <laughs> Mick, I hope you find the holiday Barbie I had. My sister got jealous and threw her in the fireplace. It's messed up. <laughs> That's so relatable though. Oh no. I've been looking for her for years. <gasps> I wonder which year it was. I hope we come across her. <laughs> it's funny, but it's not. I'm sorry. <laughs> Tony, can you say hi to Zadie? She is seven and loves you. Hello, Zadie. Thank you guys so much for the chat and coming to the live. <laughs> Sadie says, hi, hope you're my comfort YouTuber. That is my favorite compliment ever. <laughs> and I love you in your videos. This Barbie live is so cool. I'm watching the movie tomorrow. Love you. <gasps> Yay, I'm so excited. I'm watching it Friday. Does it come out tomorrow though? I feel like movies used to come out on Fridays, but now it seems like they're like coming out earlier, but I'm jealous of you guys that get to see it tomorrow. <laughs> okay, we've got a few more boxes. This, in case you missed it, is the oldest Barbie. So we're saving that one. This one's really special. It was so hard to find Barbies that are from this era. So that one's really special, but uh, let's do the pink one next, I think. Okay, this one was $130 from eBay. I'm not sure if it's one Barbie, multiple Barbies. We're about to find out. Okay, Allison, our first live stream. My nine-year-old twins love your show. Ty, oh, thank you. <laughs> I was like, Tyler, <laughs> you are very inspirational. Maddie and Savvy are immunocompromised and so shows like yours help keep them hopeful and positive. Oh my goodness, hi guys. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> I'm so happy to have you as part of the hopeful community. All right, let's open this up. Here we go. Oh, we got peanuts. Hang on, packing peanuts. <laughs> okay. Wow, this is probably the messiest live we've done. I think it's messier than the live art live, honestly. <laughs> so fun though. Oh, they're packed in here. I can't tell if it's more than one. Ah, wow, A plus packing from this eBay seller. Impressive. Okay. Oh, I think it's three Barbies. I think we're gonna have to cut it open here. <laughs> Someone asked, do you fight with your siblings? Me? And my sister, we would get in like little fights, but we got along really well, at least me and my sister personally. I think it's because it was just the two of us. So like we had to be best friends. We had no choice. <laughs> okay. Oh, they're really wrapped, but I can kind of tell what they are. Can you tell? Ah, this is going to be cool. This is going to be really cool. Okay. There was an estate sale a couple months ago and it was this house full of Barbies, like thousands of Barbies. And it was back East somewhere. So I couldn't justify going all the way out there to this house, but I'm so sad that I didn't. And I remember looking at the pictures online though. And I remember that house had a bunch of Marilyn Monroe Barbie dolls. And that was the first I'd ever seen those. And since I saw that a couple months ago, I was like, I need Marilyn Monroe Barbies. Like <laughs> there's no, other more iconic combination than Barbie and Marilyn. So today we're about to have our very own Marilyn Barbies. Okay, so the first one is, there's three of them. <laughs> Barbie as Marilyn in Gentlemen's Prefer Blondes. It's this cute, oh, this is one of her iconic dresses, this pink, and she has the diamond necklace on. I'm pretty sure that's the movie that that song is from, right? The 
Diamond's song. <laughs> it's gotta be, with like the diamond background. Oh, this one's very cute. Yes, there it is. <laughs> okay, uh, the year on this one is 1997. Yeah, they just like went crazy making Barbies from 97 to 2001, I feel like. <laughs> Collector's Hollywood Legends edition. That makes me wonder what other Hollywood legends they did. If you had any Hollywood legends, let me know. Okay, so that's the first one, our little pink one. She's cute. Next is Barbie as, oh, this is also Gentleman Prefer Blonde. It must be uh, a costume change. <laughs> that's a fun one. That's a really fun one. I'm pretty sure this dress is in a museum somewhere. This red dress that she wore and the little headpiece. That's a really cool one. The detail on the dress is beautiful. I think it's kind of hard to see in the box, but it has like these sparkles throughout. She has cute little bracelets on her arms. This is a really cute one. I think they were all the same year, 1997. Love it. <laughs> There's the actual pictures from the film. Super cute, okay. We got those two, and last is the iconic seven year itch dress. <laughs> this is the dress you think of when you think of Marilyn Monroe. I mean, this and the sparkly happy birthday one. I don't think they had that one. I'll have to see, but I think these are the three that they made. Oh, so cute though. They even have it like flipped up. <laughs> it's so good. This is also 97. Really cute. That's such a fun one. <laughs> Wow, I love these ones. I am never gonna be able to pick a favorite from this haul. There's just so many good ones. Okay, Loki. The Marylands. <laughs> Rose, hi Hopescope, my name is Ella. I love your videos. My favorite video was all the Barbie houses. I remember the tiny washing machine and your mini food collection. I hope you read this, love your videos. Well, hello Ella, I am reading it. <laughs> Thank you so much for the chat. <laughs> love to shop and buy random things. So when I found this channel, I fell in love. We are one in the same. Made to be, BFFs. <laughs> OMG, I have the 2001 Holiday Barbie. She was my first holiday doll. I even had the big Kelly baby doll. I love watching your lives, they're so amazing. I'm so, you had it back in the day. You were like, cool. <laughs> That's amazing. Have you seen the Barbie Dreamhouse makeover on HTV? I haven't yet, HGTV. I've been meaning to watch that though. The first episode just aired and it's amazing. I'm totally gonna watch it. I've been seeing the promo for it. I'm all over anything Barbie or Dreamhouse right now. <laughs> Amazing. Um, Michelle says, I used to watch Star Trek when it came out in 1966. Okay, I was right, late 60s. <laughs> I used to buy my granddaughter Barbies. She still has them and is now 25. That's really cool. I love that she kept them. So fun. <laughs> Thank you guys for the chats. Okay, we've got our gold box. And then after that, the oldest Barbie. I'm so excited. Okay. This one was, ooh, this was an expensive one, $450 on eBay. Um, hopefully it's more than one Barbie <laughs> since we paid that much for it. Here we go. Moon Reborns joining from TikTok. <laughs> we love to see it. <laughs> okay. I wanna send you money, but my dad won't let me. <laughs> I love you and it would mean the world for you to say hi. Hello. <laughs> That's okay. That's too funny. Oh my goodness. Oh, I know what these are. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. This is really cool. I didn't know these Barbies existed until I was shopping around. Ah, okay. They are <laughs> the birthstone collection. Of course, this one's on top. This one is, I think it's mine. Yeah, August. <laughs> this is the August one. I, this is so cute. I don't know how I didn't know about this earlier. Let's see, they came out in um, 2002 is when these came out. Oh, I'm sad that I didn't have her. I would have loved that. Okay, so there's the August one. You'll have to put in the chat when you see your Barbie come up. I don't think I have all of them. I think I have like eight or 10. I couldn't find the whole, I'm gonna have to find the whole collection now. <laughs> okay, this one is October. She's pretty. I love her hairstyle. Oh, their dresses are so cute. I love that they all have the same dress, but they're obviously the birthstone color. So October, very beautiful. Okay, next is, oh, June. Oh, that is stunning. 
I love that. Juna's pearl, I didn't know that. That's a really fun birthstone to have. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's another June. We've got two Junes. <laughs> They're so cute. I love that dress. That's like a wedding dress. Beautiful. Okay. Oh, these ones are pretty. Okay. Next is December turquoise. We got any December babies? That one's pretty. I feel like it should be a tiny bit more green to be turquoise, but that's okay, that's okay. Next up, oh, this is pretty. I was always jealous of my sister because she was born in September and she gets sapphire. <sighs> How beautiful. Sapphire is just stunning, that blue. Okay, sorry, I have to scoot some of these out so you guys can see them all. <laughs> Next, January, oh, that one's cool. It's kind of like vampire vibes. I like that one a lot. January, amazing. Okay. The last one I have, sorry if I don't have your birth month, <laughs> is February Amethyst. Ooh, that's a pretty one too. Okay, here they all are. <laughs> Let me know if your Barbie's missing. Who are we missing? I feel like we're missing the spring months, like April, May. I feel like, yeah, we're missing quite a few. I, yeah, because <laughs> we have two Junes, so we're not even close to the full birthday collection, but quite a bit. <laughs> I see lots of Septembers in the chat, November. We are missing December. I'll have to find the rest of them. Cause these are, <laughs> these are the best. Oh, I just hit the mic. Sorry if that was loud. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put these away, but wow, great box. <laughs> oh, I love the August one. I'm so happy that they had August. Do they have July for you? I didn't see a July. You don't want Barbie? <laughs> A July Ken, I don't know if they had Kens in that collection. There was a birthstone collection, mine's August 25th, hey! <laughs> We're the same. Angela says, I love Marilyn Monroe. I even named my cat Marilyn, that's so cute. <laughs> Do you call it Lynn for short, or Mary? <laughs> Adorable. All right, are you guys ready for the vintage Barbie? I'm so excited for this one. I should have got out my dream house from this time period. So this is the doll. If you watch the dream house video, the very first house, this is the doll that you would have played in that house with. I hope it's the actual one. I hope we didn't get like an anniversary one and it's the real deal. Okay, so this was $150, <laughs> which is kind of funny because I bet she was like $5 back in the day. <laughs> Went up in value a little bit. All right, let's see here. Here she is. Oh, there's a little note. Thank you for shopping, I appreciate your business. Okay, cool. <laughs> All right, are you guys ready for our vintage Barbie? I can't remember the year. I'll tell you in just a second what year it is. Here it is. Is 1961. So Barbie first came out in, I believe, 1959. So this is one of the first. I hope there's a Barbie in here. It says doll case. <laughs> I hope there's a Barbie and it's not just the case, but look how nice this is compared to like just the plastic that they come in now. It's got like a nice metal latch and everything. Okay. Oh my gosh, I hope there's a Barbie. I hope there's a Barbie, guys. I'm nervous. Ah, okay. Ready? Which way does it open this way? <gasps> ah! ah, there's the Barbie. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, this is a real vintage Barbie. <gasps> I can tell. Oh, wow. This is so exciting. Okay, so like the original from two years prior to this, she had the black swimsuit. I'm sure you guys have seen that one everywhere. This one came out a couple years later. Oh, this is so cute. Wow, it's really cool to see how they used to package them. Oh my gosh, all right, sorry. Let me get all these peanuts out. <laughs> I love everybody still saying their birthday month. March, I think we were missing March, I'm sorry. My sister and I had similar doll cases like that. That's cool. These are cool cases. Like they really held up well over time for sure. Okay, we've got a little closet full of outfits. We'll get to that in a second. And a drawer full of accessories. Okay, the doll though. <gasps> Here she is. Wow. That's really cool. Her hair, her hair, her hair, her hair definitely 
shows the age a little bit, but this is really good condition. Oh, she's missing a finger. Oh no, <laughs> can you guys see that? <laughs> Someone chewed it off probably. Oh no. I mean, other than the finger though, look at her little nail polish, her little swimsuit. Oh, that is adorable. Her red lipstick, let me get you closer up. It's not really in focus, but oh, so cool. So different than the Barbies are now. Very like lightweight. Okay, let's check out her outfits. So we've got this cute little leather jacket. <laughs> that one looks amazing still. It even has the little tag on the inside. This is Barbie. And then like a soft red interior. We've also got, that's cute. They come on little hangers. Oh my goodness. I feel like this comes with a lot. Like Barbies these days usually don't come with this many outfits. Um, is that a shirt? It looks kind of like a little tank top little striped tank, love it. And then a little vest, so cute. Oh, that one's fun. The gold coat with the fur trim. Look at these little hangers too. <laughs> They're like legit hangers. And then this one also has the tag on the inside. Really cute, okay. Oh, this is so fun. Oh, and then a little hoodie. <laughs> That's adorable. Oh, there's even a real zipper. <gasps> Let's see if it works. Wow, real zipper, so cool. I'm kind of confused how this goes on though because the zipper is definitely on the back. <laughs> I guess that kind of makes sense to like put it front to back on. Different, but I like it. Okay, should we open up the accessories? Let's see. Why is there so much? Is this really, did it? And, oh, I like totally didn't even notice this that I just took out. So this is, it looks like a Western set for a Ken doll that hasn't even been opened yet. That's really cool. We've got the cowboy hat, the boots, the outfit, binoculars. How cool. This one doesn't have a year on it, but I would imagine it was around this similar time. Okay, and then in the accessories box, there's no way she came with all this, right? <laughs> I feel like this person must have thrown in some stuff. Whoa, look at these shorts and look how itty bitty her waist was. <laughs> My goodness. And then, oh, I think this is a little visor hat. That's cute. We've also got, I don't know what that is. Do you guys know what that is? It's stretchy. Shorts? I think it's like underwear. That's cute. Okay, a little, probably like a nightgown. Cute, it has little flowers on it. Um, this looks like it goes to the jacket. It also feels like it's about to break any second. <laughs> but it looks kind of like a little leather belt for the jacket. Those two, okay. And then, Oh, a skirt. This is like a business Barbie skirt. That's nice. Really nice material. Some little pants that zip up in the back. Oh, they have little footies in them too. Oh, these clothes are so cute. The sweater. I love the tags that they did. It makes it look like a designer brand with the little tag in them. I don't, do they have tags in the, not like that. Not that look real in the new ones. <laughs> little orange and then a vest. Those are fun and bright. And oh my goodness, is this a swimsuit? <gasps> 1960 Barbie's swimsuit. That's adorable. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, what's this? I can't tell. Can you tell what that is? It looks, maybe a skirt. It would be a really poofy skirt on her because her waist is so little. Maybe a skirt though, or like a cover up. <gasps> Look at this swimsuit. That's adorable. It's so 60s. I love that. And then it has like an open back halter with an open back. Uh, I feel like the style is kind of coming back too. <laughs> really fun. Some little orange shorts. Ooh, what's this? I can't tell, but I, I think it's a bodysuit. I can't tell what this is though. I think it's a bodysuit. I have no idea how she would wear it, but it's gotta be, right? <laughs> really fun, okay. And then a little case <laughs> with a little flower on top. That's adorable. Okay, I have to know what she actually came with though. I'm gonna have to look it up and see because this is a lot of clothes. There's no way the Barbie back in the day actually came with this much, but. I'm grateful that this one did. That's so fun to have so much of this original 
Barbie clothing. Wow. <laughs> Guys, this was such a fun live. I had a blast. I hope that you had a blast too. Let me know which Barbie was your favorite in the chat. We kind of had a little bit of everything. I should have tried to find more like 70s and 80s. Those are so hard to find for some reason though, but <laughs> we have our 1961 and then lots and lots of 2000s, lots of 90s also. <laughs> so uh, the Bright Neon Twins, thank you for the super chat. Hi Hope, me and my sis are 10. We love you and Leo so much. He's cuter than my dog. I love your pink hair so much. Lee, they said you're cuter than their dog. Come up here. Even with his haircut, he's kind of shy about his haircut. Come in here. Come on. High five. High five. That always works. <laughs> There he is. <laughs> Andrea, your confidence inspired my daughter and I to make a Timu unboxing video. You're such a great role model and your amazing personality is infectious. Thank you so much. That's so fun. <laughs> OMG, love you so much. My mom passed a few years ago. I'm so sorry. And your vids helped me when I was sad. Thanks for that. I'm glad that I could be there for you virtually. <laughs> Hi Hope, love your channel. I'm Clara and I'm 10 years old. It's my birthday in five days, yay! <laughs> Happy birthday in five days. I hope you have something really fun planned. Trisha, hello, love your videos. Thank you so much, Trisha. Thanks for the super chat. <laughs> Jessica, hi Hope, so happy I could be part of your live. You lighten up every room you walk into and thank you for being a light in my life. Thank you so much. Thank you, Jessica, for being a light in my life and on this live. <laughs> you guys are so wonderful. Thank you so much for all of your super chats. It's been so fun hanging out with you tonight. Um, if you haven't seen the Dream House video, go watch it because it was a great time. I feel like I need to go like match all these Barbies to the house that they go to now. <laughs> but this is great. Like I said, some of these will be available on hopescope.com probably next week. So if you saw one that you like, you might be able to get one. And I will see you guys 